little early. So I am just gonna get Facebook connected here. When you do hop on, say hello. James, hey, hey. Early bird, how are you? I'm doing awesome, it's Friday. And it's gonna be an awesome night. We're giving away a Z necklace tonight. So for anyone who is joining us via Facebook, which is just circling. It's still trying to connect. Miss Darlene, hello there. Wendy, hello there. Um, Facebook, come on. Come on, come on, come on. We got the circle. We got the circle. <laughs> You're always early. Susan Foucher, hello there. Happy Friday, everyone. Yeah, Facebook's not cooperating. What's up? We might be on the app, which means we'll put music on. <laughs> Tracy, hello there. Happy Friday. You guys excited? Who will be our Z necklace winner tonight? Hmm. What's up with Facebook? I know. What's going on with Facebook lately? Well, at least we have the app and the website. At least, at least. Terry, hello there, thank you. Did it, oh, did Facebook open for you? <laughs> Susan, me. It is working? Oh, okay, maybe it's just circling on my end. Let me get, reload my Facebook and see. There we are. Yay. All right. Awesome. Maybe it's just taking a little bit to, for it to show up in common sold. All right. So the text is out. So again, welcome everyone. It's Friday night. It's game night. Robin, hello there. Um, we are giving away a Z necklace tonight. Yay. Tammy. Girl, I missed you. Um, so if you have not already shared this video out on Facebook, please hop on over there. If you are on the app or the website, please share it out publicly. Tiffany, hello, Susan. Thank you so much. How is everyone's week? Perfect. Thanks, Susan. Everybody have a good week. If you're brand new to Orbit Jewelry, and if you are joining us via Facebook, if you see the red live button, we are currently live. If you no longer see that button, you are watching the replay. You still can claim from the replay. You'll just comment sold and the number just like you see it above my head. We are also live on our mobile app and our website. So you have three ways to watch a live sale, three ways to watch a replay. All of my inventory is on the app and the website. So it is available to shop from. 24-7. Robin, thank you so much. It was a great week, Terry. I love that. Angela, hello there. Terry Rothenbacher, good evening. Happy Friday. All right. We are not going to waste any time. I have lots of stuff to show you guys. We are going to um, do the number game tonight. So I'm going to go back to my comments Hello there, Miss Carlar, Car Carla, <laughs> Miss Lori. How are you guys? I'm going to assign you a number. So I'm going to scroll back up to the top and I am going to assign you a number. So jot down your number because periodically I'm going to pull a number out of the bucket and we're going to give away some bling. So James, you are number one. Darlene, number two. Wendy, number three. Wendy H. Let me scroll down. Susan Foucher, number four. Susan Foucher. Tracy Powell, number five. Terry West, number six. Robin, number seven. T 
Tammy, number eight. Tiffany, number nine. I love that name, Tiffany. Angela, number 10. Terry Rothenbacher, number 11. Terry R. Carla, number 12. Lori, number 13. Margaret, hello there. You are number 14, Margaret. Kathy, you are number 15. I'm assigning numbers to everyone, and then periodically I'm going to pull a number out of the bucket. And if I pull your number, you are a winner. Easy peasy. So it's like a no thinking game night. But in addition to this, we also have the mystery bling bucket, which is up to seven pieces that you all will play for. We have our regular share drawing that we're going to do. And tonight is the Z necklace drawing. So anyone who shared um, during the month of March publicly, I have your names in the bucket and you will have your choice of a Z necklace, any Z necklace that I have in stock. All right. So we ended with Kathy was number 15. Cynthia, you are number 16. Cynthia Whitfield, 16. Susan Durso, hello, happy Friday. You are number 17. Susan Durso. I know I always mess your name up, right? Jarlene. And I know you tell me and I have to write it down because you know I mess it up. <laughs> Charlene, Gerline, Gerline, Charlene. I know I am not saying it right. You are number 18, my friend. Yay, Kathy. Awesome. 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 Thank you so much, everyone, for what we call spreading the love. That's sharing from Facebook. For anyone who is brand spanking new to Orbit Jewelry, pinned in the comments section are some of the details. Our shopping week runs Sunday to Saturday. So all shopping carts, because anything you claim is going into a shopping cart, which you have full control of, um, carts expire every Saturday at 5 p.m. Eastern. So you want to make sure you are checked out before that time because anything sitting in your cart come 5 p.m. Eastern, if you haven't checked out, is going to automatically drop out. If any of the pieces are on wait list, they automatically move to the next person in line. Also in the comments are the direct links to download our mobile app. So the app is available, free to download, and it has so many great features. Um, I'm gonna open it up here on this other phone to give you a quick look, if I can find it. There it is. So when you download the mobile app, it will look like this. If we are live, you will see in that first box here, a little live red button or red live button. You'll also see the red bar at the bottom indicating that we are live. So when you just click on the, all right, hold on. It's making me open Facebook. All right, now let me. I'll go back in there. I'm in Facebook. I'm in Facebook. There we go. There it is. So when you click on that live, it'll take you right into the live sale. Now I haven't shown anything yet, but 
down in the lower left hand corner you'll see a pink shop button so if you hop into a live sale after it's already started you can click on that shop button and it will scroll and show you the last 40 pieces i have shown while i'm live after the fact when the replays are up you can hop into any replay so if i hop into our last live there and you click on the shop now button you'll see everything that i showed during that live and you could just scroll through click on the piece if you would like to see the photos of it there's some really um some great features in here if you shop through the app and you check out if you happen to claim another piece that you've already purchased the app's going to tell you you've already purchased this are you sure you want to do it the app is amazing. <laughs> the app truly is amazing. <gasps> yeah. Oh, Kathy, awesome. You hopped over to the app. It is so much easier to buy on. If you're on Facebook and you're shopping, you have to type sold a space and the number, just like you see it above my head. When you are shopping on the mobile app or the website, all you have to do is click on the photo or just tap where it says sold and a little pop-up comes up, add to cart. It's definitely quicker claiming pieces from the app or the website and the video quality is a little bit better. Yeah, so if you are new, you haven't downloaded the mobile app yet, that is the way to go and that's where most of our viewers join us from. So you also get to see all the comments. If you're on Facebook, you will only see Facebook comments, but if you're on the app or the website, you will see comments coming in from all three platforms. All right, we are going to hop in here. Um, I always start with the pieces that I have on. So we're rocking some gold so I could wear the new gold earrings. <laughs> so here I've got two uh, necklaces layered. Here's the first, Spellbinding Sweetheart. Sold 100. Miss Tanya, hello there. I've got to give you a number sold 100 now all of the necklaces do come with a pair of matching earrings unless it's an urban which are typically modeled on a man this one sold 100 miss tanya you are number 19. tanya number 19. that's right susan's got a great point on the app you can be favorite pieces and then just go to your favorites, um, which is the little star down at the bottom. So you'll see the little stars in the corner of the photo. And when you just tap on that star, it will turn uh, yellow. And then way down at the bottom near your account, you'll see a little star as well. So when you tap on that, it will show you your favorites. So it doesn't actually take it out of inventory. Um, it doesn't go to your cart. Favoriting just allows you to kind of um, window shop, put things in favorites, and then go back into your favorites and kind of decide what you um, actually would like. So awesome, awesome features. Lisa, hello there. Miss Lisa, you are number 20. I'm assigning numbers if you are just joining us. Make sure you say hello. Got it. Number 19. Number 19. Alrighty. So this necklace right here, this lower heart is sold 100. The one above it is this cute little, make sure I'm on the right screen. I am. This cute little locket sold 101. 101. You hold my heart. Uh, you can see this cute little dainty chain. And then that also has little rhinestones, white rhinestones, and the cutest little earring, rhinestone earring. So these are cute. If you've got two holes, you can stick, stick that little one in that second hole. My bracelet is a coil for those of you who love coils and everything you're about to see tonight is just five dollars so cute sold 102 so that is the coil i am wearing there's a new necklace that came in 
uh, with the white, like enamel, that's perfect with this as well. 102, sold 102. Of course, these amazing, the Blockbuster, the newest Blockbuster earring. That hoop with white rhinestones on the inner part of the back as well. So no matter which way you move, you have sparkle and bling. Debbie, not too late. You are not too late. So Debbie, you are number 21. I'm assigning a numbers. Debbie Saracino, number 21. Glitzy by Association Gold sold 103, 103. And then this cutie. Gold Leaf Glam sold 104. You are James. Yep, you are number one. Um, so this has a bit, a uh, little dome shape, and then the flex of gold and green. That solid gold on the side. Sold 104, Gold Leaf Glam, sold 104. We do have this one coming with the white and the gold. Gold Leaf Glam, that is a cutie too. All of the rings do have a stretch back, one size fits most. Um, I say it's typically a six to 10. Some of the rings, uh, you'll find some might run a little bit smaller. The dainty back, this is referred to as the standard stretch. The dainty, some of them I find may run a little bit small, but I'll let you which I'll let you know which ones. All right, let me just make sure. Uh, let's see. I have Robin. I have Susan. Don Tucker, you are number twenty-two. Don. Susan Durcell. I'm just making sure I didn't miss any. Robin. Yes, you are number seven. Cynthia, I did get you. Yes. Perfect. Okay, we're caught up on numbers. Don't let me miss anybody. <laughs> Alrighty. Now, this one here, uh, this is, I have one right now that is available. The rest are in carts. But if people don't check out by 5 o'clock tomorrow, these babies will move over to the next person waiting in line. Flying Fashionista Blue, this pale blue moonstone with the tiny little white rhinestones, sold 105, 105. So currently this one is completely on wait list, but you can get on the wait list and... If someone does, like I said, if someone does not check out, then you're going. No, I have not. Um, I haven't even had a chance to look at my email yet. So don't tell me. I want to be surprised. <laughs> Alrighty. We are going to hop in here. Um, I am jumping over here. OMG. <laughs> How gorgeous are these earrings? And I think they are perfect with this. It's gonna pull those same, that green, the pink um, out of this necklace. So we're gonna start with the necklace. Crowning Collection sold 106106. This is gorgeous. That is the wood, pink wood stretch bracelet. Yes, it is. And it is such a gorgeous, bright, vibrant pink. Um, so this necklace, I should hold it up. This is pr pretty much where it's going to sit. Crowning collection. And the colors are just beautiful. 106. Looking Sharp is the name of this earring, sold 107107. 107. 
Um, so you have your lighter tones, right? The pink, the green, that aqua color that's in the necklace. Um, there's even a little hematite right at the top. So this would be nice too if you had a hematite necklace and you wanted to kind of pull that out of the earring. It is a nice, comfortable weight. You really can put the bling on the inside, put it on the outside, whichever you prefer. Look how cute with this color. Looking Sharp sold 107107. And of course, I had to put a little bling bracelet with this. Feathered Finesse sold 108108. Doris, hello there. I'm going to assign you a number here in a moment. Sold 108. Beautiful feather um, detailing with the white rhinestones. It is a stretch. 108. Let me get Doris a number. Doris, you are number 23. Doris Jean. Number 23. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. All right. Let's jump over to the wood because... So we have two wood bracelets. Look at this color pink. It's gorgeous. And we have the same exact color wood earring, which is very, very light. And I paired it with two different pieces, but I think they actually look really cute together. Um, this would be a fun kind of casual look. 103? Yeah, of course I can. Glitzy by association. Here is 103. So these are the earrings I am wearing. They are the newest blockbuster. So many of you know this one comes in silver with white rhinestones, um, gunmetal with white rhinestones, and gunmetal with hematite. So if there are any of the other colors you would like to see, let me know. I'm happy to grab them. Glitzy by Association sold 103. 103. Cynthia. Susan Dorso, that was so funny. <gasps> Cynthia Swanberg, I am going to give you a number. You are number 24. We're assigning numbers tonight and we're going to draw. So you are number 24. Oh my gosh, the pink one, the pink one is so pretty, Lori. You will love it. Yeah, Dawn, I, me too. I just wore the, the silver ones um, yesterday, I think it was. Here is that wood, bright pink wood stretch bracelet, Coconut Cove. Vicki, hello there. And I've got a little extra room. It's not tight at all. It is comfortable. Coconut Cove, bright pink. Look at the color. I want to be in the Caribbean <laughs> with this whole set on. Sold 109109. Vicky, hello there. Miss Vicky, you are number 25. Vicky. Number 25. Make sure I draw number one. The other wood bracelet is this natural tone. Boardwalk Bonanza sold 110. Miss Ada, hello there. 110. I have two of these available. So you just one on each, on each arm. 110. I'll wear it if it's no matter if it's tight or not. That's so funny. All right, let me hop back over. 
assign some more numbers. Miss Ada, you are going to be number 26. And Yvonne, hello there. You are number 27, Yvonne. Miss Diane, hello there. Diane Robertson, you are number 28. I'm going to show jewelry, pull some numbers periodically, and give away some bling. All right. So, Diane, you are number 28. If anyone is joining us and they haven't said hello yet, that's how you get entered to play. I don't know. I only see a number. I have no idea who is watching unless you actually comment. Um, so if you'd like to be involved in the drawing, there is no purchase required. Um, you just have to be a registered shopper with Orbit Jewelry. So that way I can put a credit on your account for a free piece if you are a winner. All right. So we just finished with the natural wood bracelet here are the pink earrings which are the whoops same color this is a wood earring it's, you can't even feel it it is so lightweight home tweet home sold 111 111 home tweet home see the little cutout the birds and the flower 111 This is a very long necklace. It also has the extender, your cute little seed beads in blue, pink, and orange. So it's gonna sit quite long. If you wanted it to be shorter, you could just take these, tie them, and then leave the, um, the ends just dropping in top, inside the top. But this one is Summery Sensations, sold 112. 112. I think it looks really cute. Layered with the acrylic necklace with these vibrant acrylic yellow, orange, pink, that blue. Kaleidoscopically captivating. Sold 113. 113. And the pink on this is the same pink as the earrings and bracelet. But doesn't this look cute together? Like this little boho vibe. Walking down the beach in the Caribbean. <laughs> That's it. I want it. Sign me up. Sign me up. really cute. All right, let's hop on over here. We kind of jump back and forth. Back and forth. There's another gorgeous. This would actually be cute with that pink wood. Now this one has a coordinating bracelet, earrings, and ring. This was a Fashion Fix set. This is sold 114, 114. Let me make sure it's laying flat. Beautiful, um, bright, vibrant colors, enamel, a little pearl in there. That one's 114, the matching bracelet, a lobster claw closure, flower patch fantasy, 115. Sold 115. Let me scroll because I think my comments are not catching up here. So all the pieces, every single piece that you are seeing is just five dollars, um, plus tax, which is comes out to 35 cents per piece in our state. Um, shipping. So it is a flat five dollars for the week, which runs Sunday to Saturday. So carts expire tomorrow. First time shoppers, you can use coupon code FIRST, that is spelled out. You'll get free shipping on your first order, and then after that, flat 
$5 for the week, unless your order is $50 or more, and then you automatically get free shipping. 26 is your birthday? Wow, that's awesome. That's a lucky number for you, hopefully. Am I going live tomorrow morning? I am certainly going to try to. Donna Baldwin, hello there. I am going to assign you a, a number. So Donna Baldwin, you are number 29. Number 29, I'm gonna pull numbers periodically. <clears throat> One Ted is stunning. I, hear, I agree that wood bracelet. Today's your birthday. Happy birthday. Which one, Carla? The multi neck, the multicolored necklace. Yvonne, the blue necklace on the top shelf behind me. Oh, the the seed bead one. I certainly can. And Susan, yes, I have it on the board here to show you. Oh, Dawn, thank you. <laughs> My little divas. My little divas. All right, let me um, hop on over. Let me just finish this set here, and then I'll grab that seed bead, and then we'll take a look at the yellow one. So here is that bracelet, sold 115, Flower Patch Fantasy, 115. The earrings with this set, Bewitching Botany. This is a cute earring, and I actually pulled another necklace that would be cute with this. These are sold 116, the little rhinestone bead on there as well. And even though there's a little bit of pearl, it really doesn't stand out a whole lot. 116 for the earrings. Um, the ring that matches this set, if you like big, bold, fun rings, um, this is it. Look at this. Budding Bliss, 117. 117. How cute is that? Like a pop of color. Be cute with that bright pink. Walking down the beach in the Caribbean. <laughs> that one sold 117. I think I'm a little obsessed with going to the Caribbean. Oh my goodness. And then like I said, I think the earrings, the bracelet, uh, the ring. Here is another option. Flauntable Flamboyant sold 118. This is one a solid piece with your pink acrylic and then the rhinestones. And this one you could dress up or you could dress it down, making a fun, funky little outfit. 118. All right, let me grab the seed, I mean, yeah, the seed bead next. This is another perfect one for the Caribbean. <laughs> Seed bead and wood. And we have the matching wood bracelet to go with it. If you need a chaperone in the Caribbean, I know. I'm just dreaming right now. There's no, uh, there's no trip planned. <laughs> Yes, Lori, my gosh, that would be amazing. That would be amazing. Are you talented? Are you, you know who's good at that? Carla, who's on here. Congo Culotta. So a mid-length seed bead. Uh, this one, you could actually tie a knot in it, wear it with a knot. You could twist it up if you wanted to, wear it so it's a little bit... Um, tighter around or just loose. That one sold 119 in that gorgeous turquoise. The wood 
on silver. So again, anything wood is going to be extremely lightweight. That one is a Surf Camp, sold 120120 Surf Camp, and a stretchy wooden bracelet in that turquoise and the solid wood bars coming down. Waikiki Wonderland, 121. 121 Waikiki Wonderland. All righty. So there's that one. Let's get the yellow for Miss Susan. She's so good. All right, here is Midsummer Meadow. Oh, and I have other things that I, I want to order too. Miss Carla, Midsummer Meadow, one, two, two, yellow and white. Here are your little earrings. It's like a lemon yellow. Kaleidoscopic Collision, one, two, three. Pink, yellow, orange. Post back. Um, I'm going to grab... Oh, I don't want to put it on pink, but you know what? It's the only one I have right here that's empty. So I'll put it on pink. So there is the yellow necklace with those earrings. Susan, that you were looking for. I think they look cute. Right, again, depending on the outfit, right? But you have a little bit of yellow that's gonna pull that yellow. Do you like it? I think they're cute. I think they're cute. And you could put a little seed bead, white, and the clear and a silver little seed bead. I do have TikTok. <laughs> I'm not very good at it. I've only done a few TikToks myself. All right. For those of you that have TikTok, have you seen um, the little tip where you take the egg, the wider part of the egg, and you tap the end with a spoon? And then all of a sudden it kind of pops and it what it does is release the membrane from inside the egg. It's supposed to make the egg easier to peel after it's been hard boiled or even when you crack an egg. So if you have, I tried it this morning with my eggs and it works. So just a little FYI. Bead Me Up Scotty. Bead Me Up Scotty sold one, two, four. Um, and then I had these over with that Fairy Fantasia 125. These are just the cutest little hoop earrings ever. Pastel iridescent petals with little baby pearls. Very, very lightweight. Sold 125. 125. Okay. Yeah, yeah it's, if you're looking for mine, it's um, Orbit Jewelry. You should find it. I'm just making sure I didn't miss anybody for numbers. Which end is the top? LOL. <laughs> it's the wider part. You know, the wider part of the egg. Tap it lightly. You know, like if you're holding the egg, I don't know what I have. 
So if you're holding the egg, you just tap with the back of the spoon. Just keep tapping it lightly. It doesn't break, but then you'll hear the, the tone of the tap will completely change when the membrane releases on the inside. It is the neatest little trick, and I'm telling you it worked because I tried it this morning. Oh, see, Instapot, there you go. I don't have one of those. <laughs> Um, so here we have these new earrings. If you missed these the other night, these are the cutest iridescent earrings, very lightweight. The butterfly bracelet came in today. Uh, so if you had that one on your wait list, you should have seen it pop into your shopping cart. So I will start with the earrings and we'll work down to the necklace. Here is sparkly side effects, sold one, two, six, one, two, six. Um, don't they kind of look like wings? Like butterfly wings <laughs> or a wing. And you could really wear these either side with the bling on the inside or on the outer part. Sparkly side effects sold one, two, six, one, two, six. The butterfly. Mm -hmm. The beauty of this bracelet. So you have the little iridescent stones right down the center, but it has the bead closure. So you just slide this to shorten or to lengthen that. So this will fit all size wrists. This one is Wings of Wonder um, pink, but it's definitely the iridescent. So any of the iridescent necklaces, earrings will go perfectly. Wings of Wonder sold one, two, seven, one, two, seven. So I put a butterfly necklace. Oops, as I'm not getting everything over. Crash, bang, boom. Crash, bang, boom. The Social Butterfly Effect sold one, two, eight. One, two, eight. Now this one is a longer necklace. I just moved the lobster claw down the chain a little bit. That's the beauty of a chain that's a little bit bigger where you can use the lobster claw on it. You can wear it long or you can just set that length wherever you want it. This looks cute as a shorter statement um, or a longer piece, one, two, eight in the iridescent one two eight Lillian hello there thank you I'm assigning numbers so let me make sure we get Miss Lillian Lillian you are number 30 Lillian number 30 and remember tonight is the Z necklace drawing. So we have the butterfly, the longer piece, and then this one is a shorter necklace that also has the iridescent rhinestones. Um, sold one two nine baguette style. So that would be cute too. Layered. One two nine. One two nine. Like how can you beat this jewelry <laughs> for five bucks? <laughs> So, so, so cute. So there is that whole, let me turn my butterfly. There is that whole set together. All right, let's pop back over here. Oh, I also, with that set, have a statement ring. And this one is definitely a statement. Knuckle to knuckle, sold 130, standard stretch with your iridescent stones. 130, like you can't even realize, you, unless you're doing this, you have no clue that that's a stretch ring. 130 for that one. Thank you. 
droplet like it's hot 131 a salmon color with a little bit of the pearlescent white you know what's cute what would be cute with this too um, are the earrings from the fashion fix whoop, 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 whoop. so this would pair as well but this one is sold uh, 131 131 I do have fun but you know I and I try to kind of think out of the box because I'm kind of we're all different which is why there are different like with the fashion fix you have the fiercely fifth avenue simply santa fe the musings there's different styles right so we each have um a primary style where we sometimes we will kind of expand into other styles i'm a lot of a matchy matchy type of gal right when i put on my own jewelry i tend to everything match but I've been really trying to step out of that box a little bit when I'm trying to pair because like I said, everyone's different. So I welcome any suggestions that you have. And Terry Rothenbacher, I know you're really good at pairing things together. So reach out, let me know. Droplet Like It's Hot 131. 131 glacial glaze so this will pull that white those little white stones out of their necklace 132 132 teasing torrent 133 with the white stretch so you have that little the same kind of white um smoky white frosted this one, I do have a little extra room in here, 133. For anyone who is new to my page, my wrist is seven inches exactly. Uh, so I think I have an average to slightly larger wrist, 133. But like I said, these earrings would be cute with that necklace as well. Sold 134, 134. A little pearl. Anybody have any um, fun plans for the weekend? And a band style ring. I'm just looking to see which way would I wear that. Probably like that. One three five. One three five. Standard stretch. 135 slight hammering to it and then those same kind of frosted white stones all right let's move that back over here I'm going to put this back. Actually, let's show this while I'm showing these earrings. Let's show this set. So this earring right here, which I had scanned, we've got a matching necklace, bracelet, and ring with those. I'm kind of envisioning this necklace is coming out because the bracelet was re least with that um, like aqua color uh, flower. So I'm kind of expecting to see the necklace soon. Here is Garden Grace. This too was a fashion fix set. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. The weather's nasty. There's some bad weather going across the country. Holy moly. I hope you all, if you're in those areas, safe. Garden Grace sold 136, 136, the bracelet. Now this is a piece that you really could use 
uh, with any of the iridescent, if you're gonna pull more of a coral or you're wearing coral, um, it will go with any iridescent necklace. Optimistic Oasis sold 137. 137. And the ring with this set has the iridescent stone. Yeah, we don't have any plans either. Um, other than we'll go visit my parents. And of course, I'll fill all of your orders. Botanical Backdrop 138. Standard Stretch sold 138. See how it's kind of picking up more green? Like whatever the iridescent stones, whatever you're wearing, it just tends to pull that color out. That one sold 138. Oh, I do have a nail appointment tomorrow. Joe, hello there. Show a number. Joe, you are going to be number 31. 31. We're signing numbers and I'm getting ready to pull a number. Are we ready? Here we go. First number pull. So it's up to 31. Anything over 31 will just be out of play right now. What do we have? Number 24. 24 is Cynthia Swanberg. Miss Cynthia, are you here right now? I gotta get my tickets. Cynthia Swanberg. Number 24. Cynthia, Cynthia. 24. 24. Susan, yay, she's here. Hello, Cynthia. So congratulations. You will receive a credit for a free piece. So I will be sure to add any credits tonight uh, for everyone. Let me move that right there. So congratulations. Wrong, Cynthia. <laughs> You're so funny. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Eight days straight, Lori. Yeah, that's a long time. Cynthia, you're so welcome. Sit Lillian, I have I am not changing it. Um so and I'm glad you asked because if you were on that live where I said I was changing it, I made the decision not to change it right now. Um mainly because those that use Sezzel it's gonna really impact them. And I was going back and doing um, some research and about a third of the sales are paid through Sezzel. So that's just way too many people that it would impact. But with that said, so it will continue. You can leave your car open for the week. You must be checked out by Saturday. But what I did uh, mention is I understand when periodically people forget to check out life happens things happen i totally get it i understand um it's the repeat offenders who week after week after week and i'm talking weeks and weeks at a time will put items in their cart and at the last minute dump the carts or never check out um i'm going to clearly start to monitor that and i'm going to block people from claiming pieces because it's not fair to others who may want a piece and you know they're kind of waiting to see um if they get it and if they don't i could potentially be losing sales because someone could be going elsewhere to buy that piece so um the the once in a while if you're a once in a while person who forgets i i totally understand that i i get it i am not upset about that at all um and if you find that you're really you're having a hard week and i've done this a couple of times with people if you're having a, a difficult uh week we all run into budgeting issues reach out to me i'm happy to work with you one-on-one -on -one. um 
but I'm just have to get a little bit more strict for those who just repeatedly um, claim stuff and then never purchase it. So, but long story, my policy is not changing. My policy is not changing. All right, let's continue on. For those of you who love emerald green and love a bold ring, you should have seen this one hop into new releases. It's stunning. It is stunning. Radiant Rhinestones 139. 139. Radiant Rhinestones. There is white. There is hematite. So I actually pulled a hematite necklace to pair with this. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> Excuse me. Standard stretch 139 for that. Here's the hematite necklace. So I think it would be beautiful if you have, you know, all silver or gray on, you're going to put uh, silver and hematite and you just want a little pop of color, right? Sold 140, 140. The, well, sometimes they're referred to as black diamonds or that deep silver rhinestone and the hematite. And the cushion cut, divine iridescence, 140. Exquisite Exaggeration, 141. 141. Itty bitty hematite. So you can see how much this earring just sparkles. It's very lightweight, kind of a medium length on this one. Sold 141. And for anyone who is new, um, I usually send on Saturdays, I will do a post on the Orbit Jewelry business page. I will also do a post on the VIP group on Facebook. Just, you know, thanking everybody sh for shopping with me this week and just reminding everyone that the cards expire at 5 p.m. So um, it's always a good idea to turn on notifications or even set yourself a reminder to check out before 5 Eastern Standard Time. Here is Regally Refined, and I also send a notification through the app. Um, and those are sent if you have items in your cart. So the notification that goes out through the app doesn't go to everyone. It only is sent to those individuals who have items in their cart. Regally Refined 142 Snake Like Chain, a little daintier emerald. Love emerald green. Mid length to longer. Looking like a million. Looking like a million. Now this one I think is too short to actually double. It would really be choking you, I think. Um, but it's more mid length. That one's 143. 144. Glow your true colors. Glow your true colors. Emerald and white rhinestones. 144. Has anyone seen the movie um, um, Elvis, the newer one that was recently, probably what, in the last couple of years, released? If you have, what are your thoughts on it? We have a, if you saw my post with <laughs> my friend Michelle, um, the one that I call Yoda, we have a debate going because <laughs> I think I didn't really think he looked like Elvis. 
and she was like, are you kidding me? He looked just like him and I didn't see it. So I'm curious, did you guys see the movie and what did you think? Here's a United We Sparkle 145. So Memorial Day, uh, 4th of July. This is a cute little one with the blue, the white, and the red rhinestones. Dainty. We also have it with all white rhinestones. Sold. My thing's on scrolling again. Oh, Carla, no, don't don't worry about that. It, you know, it's <laughs> not um and you know, after you've already checked out on Saturday and then somebody lets something go or they don't check out and it goes to your wait list, um, you may not even be paying attention to notifications because you've already checked out. That I totally get. That is no big deal. Um on that, Cynthia, uh, is it the is it the fashion fix? I'm gonna go just take a quick peek. If it's the fashion fix pieces, let me see. Cynthia, yes. So those are the fashion fix pieces. So the bracelet is probably, I think that one's what's on your wait list. The coil bracelet. Yeah, it is. Um, those and the other multicolor bracelet is on your wait list as well. I'll be ordering those on the evening of the 4th. So expect those probably to arrive um, hopefully by the end of next week. So hopefully in next Saturday's checkout, we'll have them in. I'm praying. Yeah. You saw it too, Vicki? You haven't seen it, Kathy? Oh, you're so sweet, Lori. Thank you. Yeah, I didn't think he looked like Elvis either. Ada, your breath is close to Memorial Day. See, perfect necklace for that. Lillian and some you thought he did, others you didn't. Oh my gosh, Carla. I wonder why. Yeah, so it's been it's been an ongoing debate. We actually actually had another friend of ours um, who hadn't watched it. And we're like, okay, are you on Team Dupont or Team Perry? <laughs> it was so funny. <laughs> United We Sparkle Multi One Four Five. Here's the all white rhinestone. One four six. One four six. So we've got a couple of different um, earrings and a bracelet. So these are pieces you could kind of mix and match with these. Head Turning Halo 147 Navy Blue Rhinestones. Is it caught up though, Kathy? You know what we have to... Um, Double check too if there's an update because Common Soul did just recently push an update. Um, so check your mobile apps. It shouldn't really have an impact on the delay, but it's possible it could. Here is Photo Finish the red rhinestone earrings, midsize hoop 148. I have these in the pink, bright pink. Like it's pink, like that bracelet that we saw earlier. Here is a silver earring with the little stars. Very, very lightweight. Happy Independence Day. Sold 149, 149. And look how cute this is. This is a magnetic closure. 
And all these little beads, you have stars. These all move on here. Now the fit on this one, let's try this on to give you an idea. So it is a perfect fit. There's a little bit of room in here, right? You can see it's got, you can kind of move it a little bit. Um, that is the fit on a seven inch wrist. And as you can see, all these beads just kind of move around on the red cording. Star studded affair, 150. This one in blue, I do not. I do not, I never, it, I never got it. It ended up uh, selling out before I could get my hands on it. <laughs> or white, no. I don't, I just have the red. I just have the red. All right, we're gonna hop behind me. Take a peek at so this little set here, this cute bracelet just arrived. It has a little wood bead. Um, and this necklace has that metallic finish on these stone little wood beads on there as well. And then I chose a wood earring. I'm getting into that season. So lobster claw extender, Caribbean charisma. Naomi, hello there. Welcome. I am gonna sign you a number here in a moment because we're doing uh, what we're just calling the number game tonight. Caribbean Charisma 151, 151. So Naomi, you are going to be number 32. 32. Naomi. So drop that number down or remember it. Five strands. No, six. I'm sorry. There's six on here. Let me just slide these over so you can see the beads that are on these. So there's six individual stretch bracelets. Es Epic Esca Escapade. One, five, two. One, five, two. Blue and silver. You can see you have the little blue bead and then that little wood bead. So this one is sold 152, 152, and a wood, extremely light. Oh no, bad storm. Oh, I know some of the places in the US, like tornado warnings, and I hope you're not getting that. Surf scene, 153, 153. This is a cute stack piece. way across. We have some blue and silver here. We're going to run through Fashion Fix tonight as well um, because those pieces that I currently have, they're going to be shipping out on Monday. So I want to make sure uh, it gets on camera tonight so all of you can see them because I'll be ordering those the evening of the 4th. Uh, here we have a blue, and then the silver is almost like um, aluminum foil. That's what it kind of looks like when I when I look at that crinkled up. One fifty four. Cute little hoop. Oh my gosh! Yeah. The way you make me wheel. The way you make me wheel. Sold 155, 155. Thank you, James. 
this is a very solid cuff. There's no squeezing this. Um, this one actually is the perfect fit. When I turn my arm, it feels a little snug, but if I'm just kind of wearing it normal and not <laughs> doing that, it's perfect. It, so my wrist is seven inches uh, exactly. It, it, it looks and feels like a high-end boutique piece. Sold 156 Bronco Bust. Top open hinge. 157. Oh my goodness, Kathy. That was sad. American Art 157. Now, what's nice about this one, this one really works for all size wrists. If you've got a little itty bitty wrist, it's, you know, it's just going to slide down a little bit further on you. Um, if your wrist is a little bit bigger, that top may just remain open, but it looks fine. Like a, because there were many bracelets that just have the opening a little bit wider at the top. American Art 157, 157. I'm going to bring this over and this. 154, 152. Of course I can. Of course. Mr. Bling's doing good. I think he's already in bed, though. <laughs> but he's up really early. 154 and 152. Oh, that blue bracelet and this blue necklace. So this is blue. There it is together. So this one's a little bit deeper, but not by much. Not by much. So this one is sold 152. And this one is sold, this necklace is sold 154. 154. That works. Let me just make sure I'm not missing anyone. Alrighty, here another layered set that I put. So this is the same necklace I have on, but this one's in the silver. And then I just put a little bit more of a chunky um, piece with it. So we'll start with the chunkier silver. Spot on sparkle, spot on sparkle, 158, a little bit of a chunkier chain. That one's 158. Same necklace as what I am wearing, the larger heart, but in silver, spellbinding sweetheart, 159, sold 159. A little dainty. I kind of wish I had these in gold. Um, the heart-shaped hoop with the bling on the outer piece. But this one, depending, we've talked about this before, depending on how a hoop sits on you, some of us, they sit, you know, straightforward. Some, they turn out more. So depending on how that is, you can just kind of rearrange and put the bling on the inside if you want. A more to love, 160. These are cute. 160. Now, I had a couple of different options for earrings with this set. If you prefer a quite a statement earring, here is Hout Hysteria. Hout Hysteria sold 161. 161. And this is a comfortable, this is definitely a statement earring. But weight on this one is not bad at all. Not bad at all. I could wear it all day. And this ear is extremely sensitive. The earrings here, this bottom heart, is the same exact 
um, heart as the necklace. So same size as the necklace. It is a post earring. Couples Retreat 162. 162. You're excited for the coil. <laughs> 162. And here's another heart. Kind of going with the hearts with this necklace. Romantic Rain 163. 163. Romantic Rain. And we have, this is on the card backwards, I think it is. We have a Lobster Claw Closure, little charm bracelet. Fanciful Flighty, Fancifully Flighty. Sold 164, 164. Let's pull a number. Here we go. Number 17. 17, Susan Durso. Susan Durso. Miss Susan, I think she's here because she just asked me to show something. So I'm pretty sure she's here. I'm going to get the card ready. Miss mm -hmm. Susan, number 17. <laughs> she was just here. Susan, Susan. Oh no. <laughs> I'm going to give her a minute. <laughs> Poor thing. She probably ran to the restroom or something. <laughs> I'll give her a minute because I know she was just here. So while we're waiting. Luz, hello there. Whoops, I just dropped a bracelet. I'm going to give you a number, Miss Luz. You are number 33. 33. All right. Susan. Susan Durso. Going once, going twice. All right, I'm pulling another number. Pulling another number. Oh, I know. That's true. That's true. She is here. I know she's here. <laughs> I wonder if she can't comment. Susan Durso, number 17, Miss Susan. I know she just said thank you, like, not too long ago. All right, well, we're going to pull another one anyway. Number 13, which is Lori Schmucker. Number 13, Lori. So we have Susan Darso and Lori. Seventeen. Thirteen. Seventeen and thirteen. Yay! Miss Lori's here. So Miss Lori, you will receive a credit. For a free piece. I will add that right after the show. So any credits that are added to accounts, they never expire. So they're always there. Congratulations. Congrats. All right. Here is a really pretty coral seed bead. 
little chunky statement piece. So this one has the seed bead earring to match. Does have the extender and then the braided seed bead. Now here's a little tip on the seed beads. This is hanging so you can kind of see there's a little bit of a bend in this. And what I suggest, when you put this on, just the body temperature is going to soften that wire. There's a thin um, wire in here. It'll soften it and it'll lay the way you want it to. Or you could take a hair dryer, low temperature, warm it up a little bit, lay it flat. You can put a book on it um, and then it's perfect, right? After you're finished wearing it, if you hang it up, same thing will happen. The gravity will kind of pull down on that. You'd have to do that. With seed bead necklaces, especially this style, I suggest laying them flat when you're finished wearing it and then it's ready to go all the time. <laughs> You've never won anything? Oh, well, congratulations. So this one is called The Great Outback and it is a beautiful coral seed bead statement. Look at the color, so, so pretty. 165, 165. These earrings, which have the coral and then a taupey color to it, these are little rubber um, discs on here. Skillfully stacked, 166. Very, very lightweight earring, sold 166. No, Luz, you can check out right after. Yeah. Yes. Um, so in case anyone heard me talking, I think it was last week, that I was considering changing my um, checkout <laughs> policy, it is remaining as is. So shopping carts expire every Saturday, 5 p.m. Standard, uh, Eastern Standard Time, sorry. Um, so you have the choice. Some people prefer to check out as they go. The, if you do it that way, it's entirely up to you. The first time you check out for the week, the system will charge you the $5 shipping fee. Anytime you check out within that same week before that five o'clock Saturday cutoff, you're not charged an additional shipping fee. So you have your choice to leave your car open for the week, check out, whenever you want prior to that Saturday, 5 p.m. Eastern, or if you prefer to check out as you go, you can do that as well. Nope, you can do it anytime, Luz, anytime. Paula, hello there. Paula, I don't think you were here already. You weren't. Miss Paula, you were number 34, 34, Paula Emerald, number 34, Miss Paula. <clears throat> okay, we're going to put those numbers back in there. So we have the coral seed bead um, necklace with the earrings and then this little stretch three-piece Coral and Silver Midsummer Marvel 167, 167, 167, and this one here, limited on this one, I have three available. Um, this is a cute little stretch bracelet as well. It has a cinnamon, a mint, a coral, um, a marigold. Where's my coral? There it is on that side. So material movement 168 sold 168. All right. I'm hopping over here. So I'm going to actually hold both of these up. This is the same necklace, just three different, I stacked these two, three different colors uh, for the same exact 
necklace. That stretch, the coral one, Lori, let me double check. Let me double check. Um, so this one here, let me take my ring off. So this one, I have a little bit of room in that one. This one's 168, isn't that cute? And this one, I mean, that's 168, let me try this one too. This one, same thing. I have a little bit of room in this one as well. This one, I think this one, uh, the smaller one, is it actually runs a little bit bigger than the other two. So this would be 167, I think. Yeah. Yes, yes. So let's start with the deeper color. Dreamy Drama 169, 169. The blue, the oil spill, the pink. That one sold 169. of different earrings. Uh, this is a one and done, sold 170. It has a bit of an iridescence to this blue. 170. I know these necklaces are so pretty. 171, a gem galaxy, a little bit daintier. 171. Look at that gorgeous. Or you could pull more pink. All for the glam, 172. 172, this is a comfortable weight uh, earring. I do have these in the multi. Um, 172, actually I think I have them in pink as well. I don't even know what I have upstairs sometimes. You guys know what it's like, right? You can relate, I'm sure. I'm a sure. Actually, there was a necklace that I was going to wear tonight instead of these. Um, and do you think I could find it upstairs? I can't. <laughs> Fit for a queen. All right. Dreamy drama orange. One, seven, three, one, seven, three. Dreamy Drama Orange. That one sold 173. This one, and I can't, that one, the Dreamy Drama Orange, I have two of. At, ooh, this one sold out. So this one is currently on a wait list. This is Dreamy Drama Green. Um, so these are sitting in carts right now. Sold 174. 174. I do love that color, those colors. But they look cute stacked up too, don't they? <laughs> and with these, I think these earrings just go with so many different um, options. Space Age Sparkle 175, sold 175. Susan, Shelly, hello there. I need to give you a number. That one is 175, gorgeous. And actually, oh yeah, these earrings go as well. So I'm gonna scan these in too. We showed these a little bit earlier. Looking sharp. So these have some beautiful colors. Where was you at? <laughs> Susan Durso, I pulled your number, girl. Where were you? Looking sharp, 107. 107. Okay. Let me give 
I have to get Susan Shelley a number. I just want to make sure I'm not missing anyone else. So, Miss Susan Shelley, you are number 35. Susan Shelley, number 35. All right. I need a closet for jewelry. <laughs> I know. Actually, I, I just said to um, Mr. Bling last night, I said, you need to take a pegboard um, and put it on the wall, like behind the door when you walk into my closet is kind of half closet, half office. So I said, because I, I can't find, I don't know what I have. And then I can't find what I know I have, but... <laughs> You just woke up, Miss Susan. I hope you're feeling okay. Alrighty, we're gonna pull a number. We're gonna pull a number. So anything above 35 will be out of play. Number 30, Lillian Chen. Miss Lillian, are you here? Miss Lillian? Susan, I was just like, oh no, she was just here. Where were you? Miss Lillian, number 30. Lillian. Lillian, Lillian. Miss Lillian. <clears throat> Lillian, I'll give her a moment. I'll give her a moment too. Miss Lillian did that, did that. We need to do this here. Oh, before I do this, oh, I know, right, Wendy? Ada, I'm here. Oh, there you go, Lisa. Good idea. All right, I don't think Miss Lillian's here anymore. <laughs> I'm going to have to stop being number one. All right, I'm going to show these two, and then we're going to pull another number. So with these um, necklaces that I showed, those that have the bright pink, that purple, blue, um, we have a couple of different rings that pair. Mm -hmm. That's so funny. Now, this beauty, where is it? Where is it in here? There it is. It's hiding on me. Oh, you do, Kathy? <gasps> One, a seven, a six. Standard stretch. So this has that pink, purple, blue, right? So depending on how the light hits it, right, you'll see different tones, colors in there. Almost a knuckle to knuckle, sold 176. And then the other is a nice, gorgeous teardrop pink. That has a piece of paper stuck to it. There we go. Look at this, kinda a big deal. <laughs> kinda a big deal is the name of this one. Sold 176. 176, isn't that stunning? 170, oh no, no, I'm sorry, not 76. 177 for the pink, 176 for that purple pink uh, tone. Alrighty, we're pulling another number. 
We're pulling another number. It's gorgeous, isn't it? No, everything is, um, for anyone who may be just joining us, not familiar, everything you are seeing, every single piece is just $5. It's amazing. It is kind of a big deal for sure. <laughs> kinda, kinda. Number 39, that one's out of play. We don't have a 39, it goes up to 35. Number five. Number five is Tracy Powell. Miss Tracy, are you here? Tracy Powell. Number five. She's here. Miss Tracy is here. Let me add a Tracy. So congratulations, we'll add a credit to your account for a free piece. So far we've given three. Um, we are going to do, actually, let me hold off on this. Actually, no, let's do this set and then we're going to do a drawing. <laughs> Waiting for your numbers to be called. Oceanic Opulence 178, beautiful red, nice, gorgeous, vibrant red, 178. You can see the little silver discs here have a little texture to them. It's almost like a, it reminds me of a, like a little fingerprint. Sold 178. It is such a beautiful red. This is a post earring silver uh, with this red thread, red thread, wrapped around that silver frame, a little hammering. Uh, 179, sold 179. Doesn't it? I look at it because the tattoo that my daughter and I um, had gotten on the back of our necks, it was actually our, our fingerprints in the heart shape. Um, all for the glam in red. All for the glam. 180, 180. So that necklace, right, you put something a little bit more blingy with it, it will dress it up a little bit, or you can definitely wear that a little. Um, uh, there it is. Can you guys see it? So the, the heart is, and she has it, we got it in the same exact spot. So one side of the heart is my fingerprint, the other side of the heart is her fingerprint. Yeah, isn't it cute? She surprised me. That was my birthday gift from her. Um, <laughs> she kept saying to me, don't make any plans for such and such a day. I said, okay. And then, but she wouldn't tell me where we were going. And then when we were getting ready to leave, she said, are your hands clean? And I, looked, and I was like, yeah. She's like, no, no, no. I mean, do you have any lotion on them? And I said, well, you know, the top parts. Yeah. She's like, okay. So now I'm thinking in my mind, she's taking me to a palm reader. I don't know why I was thinking that because we've never gone, but that's what popped into my head. And then we left the house and we pulled up in front of the tattoo parlor and I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> but I, was, I love it. You know, it means so much to me. So I will cherish it forever. Catalina Marina 181, 181, two stretch bracelets, this two, little rubber discs on here, 181, 181, yeah, it was, it was, um, I love it too, I really do. And this one here has red and turquoise. So these are three individual bracelets. You have the turquoise, the little red beads on here. Sold 182, 182. Stretchy, I do too. Although I really, I do like coils too. <laughs> I 
And here's a little mini coil. Here is a little mini coil in red. Whoops, there we go. One and down on this one, Into Infinity 183, sold 183. So that is the red. And that little itty bitty coil. I'm just going to grab this one. This is the last. Oh no, I have two, one set over there. Gorgeous light turp. Um, topaz. It is so pretty. Welcome to the Ice Age. Welcome to the Ice Age. A beautiful topaz and white rhinestone. This is beautiful in person, really beautiful in person. Diane, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Double the Drama 185 sold 185. 185. Topaz and rhinestone and a top open hinge. Call me old fashioned. Ooh, this one's a one and done too. One and done. So I've got plenty of room in here. Call me old fashioned, 186, sold 186. 186. All right, I think we hit everything up here and here. All righty. We are going to do Let's do the bling bucket. So the bling bucket, everyone is going to comment one playing card. One card only, you will comment. Um, I'll shuffle these, I'll pull a card if we have a match. There are seven pieces in the bling bucket. If more than one person comments the same playing card, I will just split the um, bling bucket between them. And of course, each person will get equal uh, amount of um, pieces. So you're going to play one um, card only. Comment one card only. I'll shuffle and pull them out. And if they, we don't have a match, the card that I pull will not go back into this deck. We'll add another piece and you'll play for another piece next Friday, eight pieces next Friday. So comment one playing card. While you're doing that, I'm going to do our regular Friday night spread the love drawing. So our spread the love drawing is always based off of a prior live or prior post. So for my last live, which was uh, Tuesday night, um, anyone who shared Tuesday night's live out or any post up until going live tonight, you are in this drawing. And we will add a credit for a free piece and our spread the love I have two cards in my hand. He has one card is Miss Susan Foucher. So congratulations, Susan. This Spread the Love is the only drawing that you don't need to be present to win. It will be the same with the Z necklace drawing that we're going to do here in a little while. Um, because it's based off of all of the shares throughout the month, um, the person does not have to be here tonight but they have to be in to get in touch with me to tell me which Z necklace they want. So Susan Foucher, congratulations. Thank you so much. Spread the love. I cannot tell you um, how much I appreciate all of you sharing my videos, sharing my posts, commenting. Um, this week has been, we've been challenged to post what we're grateful for. And you all have been so sweet with your comments and your likes and your loves. And um, that all helps my algorithm, my Facebook al algorithm and helps push my um, Orbit Jewelry business page out there to more. So I truly, truly am grateful to all of you for that. Thank you. Thank you. 
Alrighty, let's pull a card and see if we have a winner. So I'm just going to scroll back up. We have um, James, Two of Hearts, Carla, Nine of Spades, Susan, Foucher, Seven of Hearts, Paula, Eight of Spades, Tammy, Queen of Hearts, Terry, Seven of Hearts, Darlene, King of Hearts, Angela, Ten of Hearts, Eight of Seven of Hearts, Tracy, a Jack of Hearts, Robin, Eight of Hearts, Cynthia Whitfield, Eight of Clubs, Terry Rothenbacher, Three of Diamonds, Lisa, Twelve of Clubs, Kathy, Ten of Spades, Donna, Four of Hearts, Naomi, Queen of Hearts, Luz, Ace of Hearts, Wendy, Ace of Hearts, Margaret, Eight of Hearts, Diane, Ten of Diamonds, Susan, Eight of Clubs, Tanya, Nine of Spades, Yvonne, Eight of Hearts, and that's it. All right, so my deck is shuffled. I am going to spread this out as best I can without dropping them. And I'm going to dig in the middle. An Ace of Diamonds for Miss Debbie. And it is a Five of Hearts. Five of Hearts. Let's see. Do we have a Five of Hearts? Scrolling back up. Eight, nine, eight, ten, eight, ace, ace, queen, four. Oh, Donna, you were close. 10, 12, 3, 8, 8, Jack, 7, 10, King, 7, Queen, 8, 7, 9, 2. We do not have a winner. This card, make a mental note of it, this card is going into this. So this one will no longer be in play. And that means next Friday you will play for eight pieces. And I'm just going to jot that down. That is April, April what? April 7th. Wow. April 7th, eight pieces will be in the bucket. Ooh. The highest this has ever gotten is 18 pieces. Miss Tanya. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. All right, that was the share. So we still have the Z necklace to give away. But before we do that, um, we're gonna look at a couple more things. Miss Vera, what are you doing? She's just sitting here staring at me. Miss Vera. All right, copper, the earrings, exact detail as that uh, necklace, large and in charge, 187, sold 187, look how beautiful this is, sold 187, I think the earrings are perfect with that, um, but if you prefer something that's a little bit larger, here is a really pretty uh, copper hoop. So it's it's almost like one, two, three, four, five hoops connected together in sync. Now this one has a little bit more weight than the average earring. I would not say it's an anchor, but it definitely has uh, a bit more weight. 188. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine bangles. Relics on repeat, 189, sold 189. Gorgeous texture on there. Or you could put copper with a little bit of turquoise. Here is a cuff. Now this one runs big. Um, so this is definitely an average to larger, probably even a little bit higher than average. Uh, even on me, it's running a little bit large. 
Wistfully Western 190. Now it has a little bit of give, not much at all, but you just want to be careful because anytime you have something that is soldered, right, the more strain you put by squeezing it, that it can weaken that, those pieces. But what can be done with these, if your bracelets are a little bit too large, you know, in the wintertime where we're wearing a little bit more uh, chunky material or sweaters, put it on top and it holds, it fits better, and it looks really cute too. So that one's 190. And the post with the turquoise, springtime deserts, 191. 191. All righty. Let's do a drawing. Let's do a drawing for a Z piece. Okay. So in here is everyone that shared throughout the month of March. So tonight's any share from tonight, we're going to put that into um, um, April. I'm like, what is the next month? <laughs> we're going to put March 31st into the April because uh, sometimes it just takes a little bit for it to actually populate and for me to see it. So this is from March 1st to up until going live tonight. Anyone who shared publicly, you're in here. Here we go. You guys excited? Are you excited? Whoops, I just dropped one. Hold on. I just dropped one. I saw it fall. Hold up. Oh, where did it go? Vera, where did it go? Help me find it. Help me find it. I just saw it. Fall. Oh. oh, there it is. I got it. Okay. I got it. Going back in there. Here we go. <laughs> oh, my goodness. All right, our Z necklace winner is Cynthia Whitfield. Cynthia Whitfield, you are the winner. So this is how it works. Um, you can go to the Z collection on uh, the mobile app. I hope she's here. I hope she's here. She wins either way. Because, like I said, this is all based off of prior shares. She's here. Yay. So congratulations, Cynthia. You win a Z necklace. Um, so what I will do is I put a credit on your account for $25. Because the Z necklaces are $25. Um, and then you can go in and choose whichever Z necklace I have in stock. You just add it to your cart and then apply the credit to check out. Um, but if you had anything in mind that you would like me to show right now so you can see it on camera, I've shown um, all of them, but I'm happy to show you anything right now that you would like to see. But when you're shopping on the app here, oh, you're so welcome. Thank you. Um, thank you. So here's the beauty of um, the app. Right, uh, if you're on the app, across the top here, I'm gonna try and do this without turning it too, too much, but we have different categories across the top and hopefully my finger's on them and they're sliding over, but no. So there's the Z collection. Any piece that has a little black arrow, when you click on the item, you'll see an option for featured live. And this is any piece that I've ever shown um, on a live. When you click on that, it will bring you to the live sale where I showed that on camera. So that's with any piece that's in the app. If I've shown it live, you'll see that little arrow, but you can shop the Z collection. Um, I'm anxious to see which one you choose. And we are going to continue doing this 
for April. So like I said, anyone who shared tonight's video out, you're going into the April drawing. The key with sharing, and I'm going to just show um, everyone this as well. Because when I'm checking for who shared, the only names I actually see are those that shared it publicly. If you shared it just to your friends, I have no idea that that was done because um, I can't see that. So on many of the um, posts or the videos, it would show me, you know, eight shares. And when you click on it, it shows six and then it says, and two more. I don't know who that and two more is. So here is how you share to make sure <laughs> that it's public. So I'm just on my Facebook, kind of my, my feed, right? So I'm gonna go search for Orbit Jewelry. So I search for Orbit Jewelry and let's say I'm gonna share this video out. So there's where we're live right now. Right at the bottom, you see that option for share. See just below my name how it says public. So if yours is set to just friends, I won't see your name as a share. It has to be set to public. Now, this does not mean that your, your personal page has to be public. Your personal page can still be private. It doesn't have an impact on that at all. But when you're sharing it out to the world, you want to push it out public. So that way, one, I'll see your name, and two, it gets it out um, more. So if you, well, let me go back. You just want to make sure that below your name, when you're sharing it, it does read public. And I hope that helped because I know that there were a couple of questions from some folks um, that weren't sure if they were sharing it correctly. But I truly, truly appreciate it. Congratulations, Cynthia. I cannot wait to see what you pick. Um, so I'll add that credit, like I said, to your account you can choose what you want and check out apply the credit and you're good to go um all right let's do what time is it 10 52 it's almost 11 p.m um let's run through fashion fix real quick because like i said majority of these are going out the door um, on Monday. So they'll be packaged up on Sunday. I won't have them to show you uh, Sunday night. I will be ordering these the evening of the 4th. I only have a couple of these items that have not been claimed. So to claim these, if there's zero in stock at this moment, it's going to go to your wait list. I'll do my ordering the evening of the 4th based off of the counts on wait list. I should have them somewhere around the 9th, 10th. They've been pretty quick with like shipping items out. Yeah, so I probably won't have these until um, the week of 9, 10, the week of the 10th is my guess. Uh, 192, 192, this is the Fiercely Fifth Avenue set. The necklace is stunning. This is sold 192. The earrings with this set, the pearl and white rhinestone sold 193. 193. Carla, have a great night. Thank you so much. This looks like a Z bracelet. Uh, and if you if any of you have any of the pearl Z necklaces, I highly encourage you to get this one. It is stunning. It is a gorgeous coil where the small beads right in the center that gradually go up to the larger pearls on the outer part sold one. Oop, didn't scan. Didn't scan. Hold. What's the matter? Oh, the earrings didn't scan either. Did they? There they go. So the earrings are sold 193 193 
the bracelet, $194. Stunning, $194. The ring with this set is also on wait list. Really bubbly, $195. Standard stretch, sold $195. Oh, this blue set is so pretty. Oops, I want the necklace first. Flower Crown 196. Tammy, have a great night. Thank you so much for joining us. 196 Flower Crown. 197 European Energy 197. I know I'm getting a little sleepy myself. We will do a um, I will do a coffee with Kim in the morning, 10 a.m. Eastern. We'll just do a quick 30 45 minute live, have coffee together. That one's 197. 198 Medieval Magic Lobster Claw 198. The pearl ring. This is so beautiful. Uh, so there's openings on either side. Maypole Dance 199. 199. So that's the second Fashion Fix set. This is a fun, kind of fun, funky set. Hot Hippie sold 200. Yvonne, have a great night. Thank you so much. Coffee with Kim tomorrow morning, 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Sold 200. The Little Choker. So on the chokers, you'll find the four inch extender. The colors on here are beautiful. And this one will have the little beads that read shine on. Little choker, gorgeous color, want 201. My ring, Paula, of course. <coughs> Excuse me. I just have to find it, which is right here. <clears throat> Love this. It's a little dome shape. Gold leaf glam, gold leaf glam. And it has the flecks of gold and green. Is it the camera or is it the ring that's fuzzy? I think it's the camera. That one is sold 104. The matching bracelet to that choker, three stretchy pieces, the same charms on the necklace, uh, 202, 202. <laughs> Farah looks like she's ready to pounce on something. 203, very, very lightweight, that cobalt blue, Lightning bolt. That one's 203. I think this is the only set. I don't know if I have the whole set in stock. Um, yes, yeah, so I do have this one has not been claimed yet. This is a again a kind of a funky industrial um, style. 204 running out of steampunk multi-chain the gears which do have a little bit of bling sold 204 204 the earrings i think are on wait list yes they are so here are the matching earrings your little gears 205 205 206 
I just want to make sure the right side is going out with the rhinestones. Beads on one side, multi-chain on the other, lobster claw closure, 206. The ring with this one. This bear is hanging out right here with me. Not meowing, which is unusual. <laughs> Blowing off Steve Steampunk, 207. 207, a standard stretch. And the last one, I think... I don't know. I'm kind of tossed. Um, I do think that multicolored one is cute. The more I look at it, I'm like, I really do like that. But this set here, I think this one is my favorite for this month. It has a gorgeous colors, snake-like chain. Like, how in the world is this $5? <laughs> so you have that teal and almost like a terracotta color 208 so this one too is on wait list somebody did claim this particular set it will be going out to its forever home on monday catch me if you can 209 209 lobster claw closure 209 210 Beautiful. I just love the colors. And the cording, coordinating ring with this one is 211. Sold 211. Standard stretch. Little opening on the side. That one is 211. All right, my friends, so those are the fashion fix pieces. I will be ordering those. So if they went to your wait list, um, they will remain there until I place my order the evening of the 4th. Once I receive them, check them into the system, they'll move over into carts in the same order that they were claimed. So tomorrow morning, I will do a Coffee with Kim at 10 a.m. Eastern. I hope you guys can join me tomorrow morning. If you can't, just a reminder, to everyone, shopping carts expire tomorrow, 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So you need to make sure you're checked out prior to that time. Um, I will put a post up on the Orbit Jewelry Business page as well as the VIP group. If you are not a member of the VIP group, when you get a chance, go over to Facebook Groups and then search Orbit Jewelry. You'll find us. Uh, the official name is Orbit Jewelry Papa Chicks VIP page. Request to join that. So I always do a post every Saturday thanking my customers for shopping with me and just reminding everyone checkout time is 5 p.m. and all orders will ship out on Monday. Um, so I just want to say thank you to all of you for your support. Um, the likes, the loves, the sharings, the comments. I truly, truly. Oh, Susan, Cynthia Whitfield won the Z necklace tonight. Yes. But we're going to do it again in April. So we're going to continue on with doing this um, because it is, it is helping. It truly is. My customer base is growing and I cannot thank you. It's because of all of you. So thank you so, so much. Join me tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. Eastern for Coffee with Kim and more bling. Um, stay safe. If, if any of you are in those storms, please take care of yourselves and have a great, great night. And I will see you tomorrow morning. Good night. Thank you.